are getting breakfast at In N Out Burger and Mill Valley. We are waiting for our number 16, correct? Yes, 16. So, you know yesterday was our last show, so why are we going back again? Strike. We have to actually put away all our stuff. We're actually, we got the lights down yesterday, after the show. Some of the lights, we have to take down the rest of the lights, load them in the van, grab my sound trailer, bring it back to BBI, bring the lights back to the office, and then organize the light, Sh uh, whatever it's called, the closet, the light closet. Gotta organize that. Won't stay. Sixteen. Sorry, I said sixteen. You were like. You spin me with, but with the good creation. Only it has to be cooler than the ceiling. Going this. That's right, I'm gonna look yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, try it. Uh, the lens doesn't stay in the middle. Why is the red light still on? Oh, I know why the red light's still on. Because I wasn't recording before. Fucking your hands. That looks awkward, though. So we're getting ready to leave. We have no room for the wagon, so we just hooked up to the back of the van. There it goes. That's hilarious. Bye, Scott. Okay. That's a wonderful parking job, Scott. It's 1.30 approximately. Actually, it's later than that now. And we are leaving the bowling alley for the last time this year, probably. And they're tearing up the landscape. We have to unplug all of the lighting plugs from the dimmer. There's uh, 24? Yes, 24 plugs. Ready? All at once? Will that work? <laughs> nope. No. You know why? Because when you're pulling it that way, it's pulling them at an angle. They, they don't okay, come out ready? that way. You can't even pull out two at once. You gotta pull them straight. Nice. Freedom! Except for the power. This is one of the biggest ways to plug in an appliance machine. To plug in all five of those. 
here's a portion of the lights we used for the show. We had five more of these, so this is half of these type of lights. Um, he's already taken a few down there. We had more of these. We had twice as much of these. So this is like maybe half of the lights we used. All right, this is two more than half of the lights we used. So take out two, and then that makes this half. No, take out two of the Lecos. Those two. Take those two away. Oh no! Good save. Good save. That's half of our lights. Half. Bye. Bye. Do it. Ready? Mm-hmm. It's not really working. There it is. A little... There's my truck, right on my eyes, right? Yep. Wait, wait. About there. Wow. That's cool. How well did it work? Whoa. That's actually pretty cool looking. so bad. People in the truck were looking at us. Funny. They're just hey, what? What's he doing? That's funny. Hey, it's turned purple. <laughs> so this is the last time we will see the Vespa. It is in the costume shop, whatever it's called. Say bye Vespa. <laughs> oh how cute. It said goodbye to us. Hey. How many? That many. So, we brought the van up to Bernal Heights, which is where the van stays for now, because they need to use the shop to store hey. things. What? Stadium. Or they football stadium. Stadium. Yeah. stadium of some kind. No stadium. But anyway, since we're at Bernal Heights, we thought we'd take a walk because this is actually one of the highest points in San Francisco, I think. I mean, it's pretty high. And when we get to the top... Which one? I was gonna go... I saw this first. When we get to the top, I will show you what you can see from up here. It's pretty cool. So looking over this way, there's South San Francisco. Bernal Heights is right here where we are. You can see out there stuff. Freeways. And this is San Francisco. 
is pretty cool. And there's the Golden Gate Bridge, way over there. I don't know if you can even see it on the camera. Maybe. But that's where we have to go to drop off little plug adapters to go way over there through all of this. Somehow. Pretty cool up here. And you can even see Oakland way over there. Richmond. So many cities are in view right now. So that's what we see from up here. It's nice. We are going to a different vantage point on the other side so you can see the rest of the city. There's a siren somewhere down there. Somewhere over there. Can you see it? That's probably really hard to see. I have no idea where to look. There's an entire city down there. True. Oh, there it is. Where? Clump of trees to the right. White triangle houses, big building. Big white building with lines, mm. with the windows, big one right there. Okay. Can you see that? Right yeah. above it. Right above it. Grove of trees down there. Uh-huh. Next to Cesar Chavez. Yeah. It's coming out right there. See it? No. <laughs> no. He's turning right onto Cesar Chavez, past those little pine trees. Now he's moving left against the big three-story white building, and he stopped. Nope, he's still there. Orange house is right there, next to the left of the three-story building. Uh-huh, kind of see where you're talking about. You entered right there. It's right there. <clears throat> well, I saw him. Now he's behind this grove of trees. This grove of trees? That one. That grove of trees. Okay, kind of see it. Anyway. Talk. This is that building that has the windows that Scott was pointing at with the fire truck earlier. That's cool. Went out there and turned right. It looks so much different down here. Yep. Rerouting. Thank you. I'm just gonna go this way anyway. I'm making my prediction right now that the flying van means traffic. Flying van means traffic. There isn't really any. Well, that's not bad. Here. Well, we are standing now Guitars. where the stage, backstage area used to be. And here's the stage now. It's just a big light spot. There's where the stage was. You can see here's where our ladder was for our projector. This is a pathway here and here. Stairs went here. This is all just understage stuff. Pretty cool. It doesn't look that big from when it's here. Oh, all the fences are gone too. Fences are gone. That's why Johnny left. And concession stand is still there. Well, the tent. My trailer's gone. Cool news. All the stage in the trucks. Ready to go? Yeah leave this place forever forever until until next time next time which mm, don't know when it'll be and Mr. Sting and the Blue Turtles and Dolet M and Janet P Dolet McDonald <laughs> that guy was weird